To facilitate the continuous growing and future development, Wing Chit Industrial Estate was built in 2001. Occupying a total area of 110,000 square meters and having six well-equipped factory premises. With our own in-house R&D department including product and graphic design teams and hand sampling department, we're capable of any OEM and ODM projects. When a project is set, design review meetings will be held between salespersons, product designers, engineers and the QA team to discuss production and safety issues. Technologically advanced machinery, like a three-dimensional scanner will be used sometimes to assist the hand sample preparation and structure drawings of the items. Once the drawings are done, hand sampling for the items can then commence. Three different methods will be commonly used, including clay or PU sculpturing and free form system that links up to a rapid prototype machine. This advanced system enables the sculpture maker to do the sculpturing on computer with a higher accuracy and fineness level. When all necessary data are created and exported, the rapid prototype machine can then automatically produce the hand sample as per the drawing made on the software. After the painted hand sample is approved by the client, the moulding procedure can then be started by designing the layout of the mould. Advanced machinery like CNC will normally be used in the moulding workshop to create the metal parts that are needed for etching the outlines and shapes of the items on a stiff stainless steel surface. The electric discharge machine will then be used for the etching of the patterns on the mould by using high voltage electricity. Once the mould is completed, it will be transferred to the next section, the injection workshop. The mould will be loaded to the injection machine for trial shot or mass production purposes. And up to this stage, the initial appearance of the item can now be seen. In this workshop, another high-tech equipment, robotic arm, can be found. It makes the collections of injected items easier and quicker, requiring less labour contribution and effort, which leads to the increase of efficiency for this department. Capsule toy item is one of the main product streams of Wing Mao. An automatic system was built to lower the cost, make the production more stable, more productive and more efficient. The system will automatically mix up the raw material and pigment, then transfer through the ducts to specially adjusted and modified injection machines. After injection, the next step will be painting of the items. Different painting methods can be found in this section, including a widely used spray paint method, which is to use pressurized spray paint guns to color the items. Mass spray painting inside a water curtain station is another option for coloring. Automatic spray paint machines will be used to minimize painting workload for workers and to speed up the spray paint procedure. Last but not least, Pad printing method will be adopted when logos or detail patterns have to be printed on curved surfaces. After painting, the semi-finished items will have a very pungent smell caused by the paint that is used. To comply with food grade and most safety standards, the odour must be removed. Therefore, the items will be moved to the oven room for a certain period of time using heat to minimise the smell left on the toys. To further remove the pungent smell on the toys, the semi-finished products will then be taken out from the oven rooms and transit to airing rooms with air showering and highly ventilate facilities. Inside the airing rooms, the residual smell left on the toys can be sucked out to ensure the toys are free from smelly hazards to children and to meet the required standards and regulations set by customers or countries that are going to export to. It is important to keep the dust-free workshop's hygiene, germ and dust-free. So before entering the room, the person must wear the gown appropriately. Shoe masks have to be put on to prevent the dirt left on shoes from being carried into the workshop. 
Hands will have to be washed thoroughly by hand soap for at least 10 seconds. Then hands must be completely dried and sterilized. Finally, a face mask must be worn and make sure everything is tidy before the final step for getting into the dust-free zone. When the person has tidied up, he or she can then enter the air shower room to remove the excess dust left on the body. The showering will last for exactly 15 seconds and the person can now enter the assembling workshop freely. It is important for a person to be hygiene to enter the dust-free zone. It also applies to the components that were manufactured in non-dust-free areas at earlier stages. So they will have to go through a UV tunnel to kill the germs and remove the dust attached. To assemble the toys, assembly lines will be formed. Each worker will be assigned to a special task and a complete product will be made by combining all different small parts together. Sonic weld machines can be found and will be used to join different parts together, while heat transfer machines will sometimes be used to apply graphics on item surfaces. When assembling is completed, the items will be shifted to packaging workshop for packing purposes. Many different types of equipment will be used to facilitate the packing of the products, such as polybag auto sealer. Technologically advanced automatic bandolier wrapping machines can also be found in the packaging workshop, enabling a fast bandolier wrapping procedure. Again, packaging lines will be formed and workers will be assigned to different tasks to pack the toys into its required packages such as capsules. When the packaging is done, the finished products will have to go through a metal detector, testing to ensure no harmful metal pieces are mistakenly being packed together with the toys. Once the massed finished products have been retested in QA laboratory and passed all the testing requirements, they can then be packed in cartons and sealed by the semi-automatic carton sealing machine. Wingchit is capable of manufacturing food-grade products and candy toy items. Therefore, an air and humid conditioned storage room is necessary for candy storage. Temperature and humidity level of the room will be checked by an appointed person every two hours to make sure they meet the required levels in order to ensure the stored candies having their best quality within the most suitable environment. To ensure the trial and finished products meet the regulations and requirements set by importing countries and customers, different testing has to be undergone before they can be mass-produced or shipped out. Chemical testing like XRF heavy metal detection and physical testing included, tension to failure testing, compression testing, drop test and torque test etc. will be carried out in this section. Our logistics centre occupies a total area of over 43,000 square feet, having 24 loading bays enabling 24 trucks with 40-foot containers at the same time. For anti-terrorism purpose and to meet customers' requirements, we have correct loading method to follow and strict internal security monitoring process for the loading and unloading of goods. The briefing of production flow has completed. By going through each step in the flow, an untouchable concept has at last successfully evolved to a tangible product. Other than ordinary small and capsule toys, Bouncing Ball is also one of the hot selling items of Wing Mao. Wing Chit has her own Bouncing Balls making machine, capable of producing balls that with different colours, transparent, glittered or stuffed and in different shapes to fulfil customers' demand. To prevent trespassing and make sure the industrial estate is in perfect order, 
Security guards and control room will perform their duties following preset instructions strictly. Security guards will ensure no worker will go out of the estate without permission during working time. They also have to register all visitors' details as record. During peak seasons of flu, security guards will measure every incomer's body temperature to make sure they are safe and will not carry or spread flu around in the estate. Employees are one of the most valuable assets that a company has. It means even more for an ICTI certified corporation like Wing Chit. It is vital to take good care of the workers, both physically and mentally. Therefore, Wing Chit provides nice and comfortable dormitories for workers' accommodation. A beautifully landscaped garden for leisure and relaxation activities. Recreational facilities like basketball court, ping pong tables and the bats. Wing Chit also built an informational and neat library with many books, magazines, newspapers and internet surfing stations for workers to have fun while enriching their knowledge at the same time. To further enhance workers' knowledge, training classes upon different topics will be held regularly. For dining needs, Wing Chit provides a huge and hygienic canteen to all junior staffs and a nicely furnished and air-conditioned room as canteen for senior staff. To provide more leisure activities to employees, a clubhouse within Wing Chit Industrial Estate is being built at the moment and will be completed by the end of 2010. Facilities like a gym centre, karaoke room and theatre etc. will be equipped for workers to enjoy when they are off work. For eco-environment protection, Wing Chit has eco-filtering towers to filter gaseous matter in the air arise from the painting procedures. To further strengthen your confidence towards our company, Wing Chit has successfully obtained many certificates by qualified authorities, including certificates of ICTI, ISO issued by CQC, Intertech, GSV and SGS. I hope you enjoyed this video tour of our company and factory and wish to serve you in the very near future.